Hi, my name is Shelby. Hello, my name is Catherine Wong. Hi, I'm Jillian Rothy. Hi, my name is Erica Wajardo. Hello, my name is Elizabeth Ekasa. Hi, I'm Issa. Hi, my name is Eunice. Hi, I'm Farah. Um, I am a senior bioengineering student at the University of Pittsburgh, and I want to see more patient-driven design in medical devices. My goals as an industrial engineer are really to help other people. And I want to know how to make humans and automation better team players in high-risk, high-consequence environments. The problem that I want to be able to solve is to make MRI machines cheaper for people to use. I want to solve the housing crisis in Milwaukee. I want to 3D print prosthetic limbs in order to create a more cost-effective and more accessible alternative to commercially produced prosthetic limbs. I want to see more clean manufacturing so that the environment is safe and so that we don't have harmful chemicals going about into our world. I envision a future where all engineers, men and women, adopt a circularity mindset so that we can start to develop products and processes that are truly sustainable. So working on a supply chain optimization project to reduce the number of truckloads that, that we bring in. Uh, I'm really passionate about space exploration. And I make technology be accessible around the world. The problem that I want to tackle in my career is the issue of an outdated electrical grid. The problem that I really want to solve is engineering training. I want to solve any hard problem that is just complicated and interesting to solve. One thing that I would love to see consistently in my industry is for women to always feel empowered and to feel like they can speak up um, as well as making sure that they can feel their complete self. I think that industry, the marine industry, is a little bit behind in understanding that women are capable too. So I think the problem that I want to solve in my career is to show them that women can be just as strong and smart and capable. I would like to see more women in the manufacturing field. I would really love to see more women involved in the oil and gas industry. To see more women go into technology, especially electrical. And I want to see more women in STEM breaking boundaries and more women having leadership roles in the integrated supply chain. And I would love, love, love to see more girls in STEM. I would love to get women in more leadership roles. And I want to see more compassion and empathy in today's leaders. Or that I want to work towards is giving back to the women in STEM in Puerto Rico that want to advance their careers. No matter which region of the world you are from, the, the biggest problem for us women has been is to be able to stand up uh, in a very male-dominated um, environment, uh, to be able to be yourself, to be able to um, express your thoughts and to be treated fairly and equally. Uh, I want to open this opportunity for other people from the country I came from, from the, for third world countries uh, to have knowledge about programming, uh, to, not, to know how to code. It's, it's, it's a beautiful thing. Especially for Latina women or Hispanic, Latinx and women in, as a whole just to be able to see themselves and have that person where they can say I want to be them.